Hi, it's me, Sandy, and I'm super excited to unbox with you my Diptyque Orpheon. So this is only my second, um, is that my, yeah, my second niche perfume purchase um, from the source. And so I, I have two other niche perfumes that I bought um, like as partial bottles and things. So um, this is only my second time to get to see a whole presentation and I think it's beautiful. I wasn't expecting it to arrive today. So I'm gonna go ahead and open it. Let's see, looks like you slide this off. Yes. Easier said than done. Oh man, you're gonna spend 20 minutes with me trying to slide this thing off. Okay, then it's the red box that says Diptyque. I can hear things rattling around in there. And so we have an envelope, which I'll look at. Ooh, I'm so excited. Um, this is the Orpheon whoa, where's my camera? <laughs> the Orpheon uh, sample that they send you, like uh, more places are doing now where they send you a sample of your fragrance so you can return it if you don't like it. Um, and there's the whole bottle. Oh, I'm excited. And then I have some samples here. Um, Philosikos Eau de Toilette. Um... What is this? Eau de Sens, um, Eau de Toilette, and Volutes Eau de Parfum, I think. Yeah, Eau de Parfum. Oh yeah, Black Box is Eau de Parfum. Um, I bought the Volutes. You get two free samples. Um, but I wanted to try that too. So let us partake in Orpheon. I've smelled it on a paper strip and I was able to get one tiny little spritz on my wrist once. Um, it's a unique scent, wait. I'm gonna go up here because, no, right here because I don't have anything else lingering there still. I remember the first time I smelled this, I was like, what? That's not what I expected. I had a way that it smelled in my mind and this was not it. <laughs> but then it grew on me and actually, interestingly, I immediately like it this time. And maybe it's just because it wasn't what I thought it was going to be the first time. So my brain registered that kind of as a fail, but it really wasn't a fail. It's very clean and soapy, and I've heard people say that. Um, oh my gosh, I'm not good with notes, but I'm definitely getting like a pink, like a light pink soapiness, if I had to assign a color to it. And I don't even mean feminine, I just mean light pink, if that makes any sense. Um, it's a, a love, it's a love, it's changing. Let me see here real quick, if it tells me the notes here. Enjoy this unique and beautiful scent. Well, I will, I already am. Um, okay, no notes listed there either, but it's soft and it is intimate. It's, um, there's no screechiness. There's no like citrus blaring at the top, which I love when that's what I want. It is clean and it's getting a little more powdery now. I'm completely blanking on any notes. Juniper. 
I get that. That's the fresh quality. I'm trying to think what else. There was juniper and powdery notes and musk. I really love it. I'm gonna play with it some more. I have a feeling I will not be sending back my Orpheon. And I'm also looking forward to smelling Volutes and Eau de Sens and Velocicos. I've smelled Velocicos in the store, but never on skin. So this will all be new to me. <laughs> Just throw it anywhere. And I will um, share my thoughts later. Hope you have a good day. And I will try to get a quick shot of my beautiful whippets.